Good morning, you afternoon, guys. My name's the Anita, and welcome to an unboxing video. I I've bought some things, so let's just open them up and test them out. First off, we have this. It's a package that appears to be made entirely of tape. There's literally, it's just tape. There's nothing else packing it. But in here is a camera that I bought. So currently, I'm using a Canon IXS Ixus something. 160. It's not quite up to scratch. The main reason I'm, I've bought a new camera is because the audio quality on that is pretty awful. The audio quality right now is pretty good because I'm using this for the audio. This is a camcorder and it has an external microphone that should dramatically improve audio. So let us... Uh, the packaging, it's bubble wrap, but with just about three layers of tape over the top. Who? Who? Just like that. Scissors are required. All right. So here is the microphone. It is a K and F concept quality camera accessories. Let us get this open. Ooh, it's like the uh, the hundred thousand subscriber plaque. It's got this sort of foamy mesh over the top. Listen. Though no, and then we take it off, and boom! There's instructions. Okay, reminder: when you stream, German, all of that. All right, so now we have the actual microphone itself. Look at that! I, I must say, the packaging. I do like the, uh, the packaging is very nice. So this is the microphone itself, like the bare bones of the microphone. Yep, it's got a little cable and a little plug. And then this muffler goes over the top to reduce wind noise and stuff, so I'm just going to put that on. Alright, that is on there now, that is looking very nice. Um, there is various settings, so, so there is a 10 decibel setting and a 0 decibel setting. I presume it's for various noise levels and stuff, so, and then, ooh, it comes with a little mini battery. I do have some spares of these, but, uh... Alright, so we have all of that, and that is everything in the microphone box. Right, so now the actual camera. Oh, this is required again. Uh, it's an Audro camcorder HDV Z or the Z20. Um, I'll leave a link in the description if you're interested. Oh, it should be about the same quality as that, so, but with better audio. Right, so, this is the box. There's a, there's a dude. I don't, why do they just have like a random guy on it? Like what, how is that gonna help the, the marketing? Okay. There's a manual, user manual, coolie uli. So we've got a plug, adapter, thing. Ooh, it comes with a little bag. Right, this is the actual camera, It. this is bubble wrap. This is the actual camera itself. And I got the camera with a deal that actually it comes with a free 8 gigabyte SD card. That wasn't really the selling point. I have a bunch of SD cards, but um, just just randomly just placed in the box as an SD card. So that's that's handy. First of all, what I'm going to do is plug in the microphone. Plug the microphone in. All right. So there is the microphone on. Just put the SD card in. First off, we have the battery. So let's open this baby up. All right, battery is in. It should work now. It's on and it's filming, okay. And I completely forgot about this, but it's actually, this viewfinder is actually touchscreen, which is another amazing added bonus. So if we go into mode, and we have these set, these settings. So uh, playback, and then I can view the video. I just filmed. Let's just see what else is in the box. So we have a, a HDMI cable. So this, uh, you plug this end into the camera and this end into something that has a HDMI port. So these monitors both have HDMI ports. So, oh, oh, this is amazing. Look at that! That that is pretty cool. I'll, I'll I'll give you that. That is that is 
fairly decent. Uh, all right, I'm gonna. I want to test out this remote control. I'm. I'm interested to see what the remote control does. Right. Let, let's. Let's test this out. I know you can actually see what the camera is seeing. So. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's very not. So the remote control. I can do stuff with that. Finally, we have the charger. But anyway. So, yes, that is everything in the box. Um, I have another parcel, which is a camera crane, so let's 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 move on to the, the camera crane. Let us open this thing. Oh, oh, it's, it's, a, it's a box inside a box. <sighs> Alright. It is a camera jib, four foot jib. Achieve crane-like motion and high, low, horizontal shot. Fairly decent. Oh. Alright, so it's in its little bag carrying case. Mm. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, it's very oily. Ooh, I just got oil all over my hands. In the pole. Okay. A pack of things. A that. Okay. So, it is now attached to my tripod, and I can move it around. It's not the best place to try it out in my room where there's very little space. This tripod I have isn't really ideal. Um, it doesn't really support things this heavy, so I think what I'm going to have to do is buy a new tripod that is a bit more substantial. So I'll just go just go buy a new tripod. Wow, that was quick. So in this box we have two things. A tripod and a mount for the tripod that is capable of supporting the crane's enormous weight. Alright, so we've got this so, let's just set this guy up. All right, this tripod isn't actually quite as good as the tripod I have over there, so I'll probably be using the tripod that that camera uh, is on for the crane. But for now, I'll just do this. So then we have this special mount. Now this is a heavy duty mount. This is, there's no messing around with this mount. This mount is, no nonsense. Just, just, just look how big that thing is. Like, wow, wow, what? It, it's on this big ball bearing, so it can move around very easily, and it's capable of supporting weights up to 15 kilograms, so easily enough to support the crane. So we just screw that onto there. Screw this thing onto there. Put the crane onto the mount. All right, we finally can put the crane. Okay, we can now see the crane fully in its, in its thing. So we have this huge array of various mounts and accessories, which is a bit over the top, but yes, that's quite nice. This is the crane at its smallest setting. Right, so now all we've got to do is uh, put the new camera on the new crane. All right, so as you can see, I now have the camera mounted up on the crane, and now prepare to get blinded. Ooh. Ooh, that's nice. So smooth. Let's go from down, down low, and up high. Microphone. So yeah, hopefully you liked those nice shots that I just got there from the new crane and the new camera. Overall, um, I think it works well and I'm going to keep all of it and use it in videos. I didn't have to return anything, apart from, like, a lot of things, actually. I returned th three things. 
that you didn't see. You may have wondered, oh, why is this tripod different? Oh, I returned the old tripod. Ignoring the fact that I returned three things, I didn't have to return anything. Overall, good purchases. I'll leave some links in the description if you want to buy any of them. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a little... If you've enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you're new, and I will see you guys in the next video. See ya.